What's up guys, Still Venom here, back with another reaction, back with my buddy Nubi. Yes, you got Libyanka today, back with a new artist and a non-new artist. Um, a Libyanka People featuring Ira Starr and Omale. Um, it's, a, it's a good song, man, you know Ira Starr always does her thing, but Libyanka did her thing too. It's, a, it's another Afrobeat song. Um, okay. And these, so these are both African artists? Well, I mean, obviously, Iris <laughs> Star is, but I assume um, yeah, Bianca is as well. They're, they're all African. Um, this, is a good, this is a good song, man. I like it. Okay. It's, it's been on my playlist. I've been listening to it. And it looks like this is another pretty new song, or at least... Yeah some of the postings for it five days ago is when this was posted so yeah, it's been on it's been on my playlist we're yeah. listening to it at work this this week tuning people out hitting it early <laughs> that's what she said but, um, <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> oh man i feel like i feel like michael i couldn't i couldn't pass it up <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, without further ado. Yeah, let's get into it. Oh, yeah, dude. Dope song, man. I like it. I, uh... I think this is maybe the first song we've heard, um... Afrobeats-wise, or... 
just African music that we've heard that was uh, a little more like on the the depressing side. <laughs> You know what I mean? <laughs> like, I don't mean like true. I, that doesn't true. take away from the song. It was a great song, but I just mean like most of the stuff we listen to is um, like very upbeat. Happy. Yeah, happy about um, you know, uplifting the community or how they're on top or you know what I mean something to that effect. But this is like the first one I think we've listened to where it was just a darker theme the through through the whole song. Low key, that's one of the reasons I like it, man. Cause I'm be honest, it's kind of why I like it. <laughs> this is one of the reasons I like it, man. It's like, like he said, like most of them are like upbeat, like happy, joy. Like, ain't, ain't nobody like that all the time, right? Which I mean, those are those are great songs still, but I get what you're like. Sometimes, no, I don't know, this movie. is much more raw in a way. Yeah, it's more real she said a line that uh resonated with me that was like i'm probably gonna mess it up but it was something to the effect of i'd rather be alone than be around fake friends or something like that and i've felt that a lot in my life where i just feel like i'm giving so much of myself to Mm -hmm. people that just i can't even barely get a happy birthday from you know what i mean and it's just like you 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 feel that way sometimes where you're just like man like do these people even give a shit like if i were to just drop off the face of the earth most of them wouldn't even notice for so it's just (laughs) they won't be like what happened to them yeah or it'd take them a while you know it'd be like several months before they finally realized oh shit what happened to them right so who's Dude, I used to... All right, <laughs> man. It, I felt like that before. I feel like that a lot actually sometimes. But I think it happens like a some... lot more when you get to our age too. Yeah, like because you don't be having time to deal with fake people. Like if you, like like if people don't want to be in your life, you ain't got time to be like get out, leave. Right, and I think as you get older too, lots of people that you thought were gonna be in your life forever suddenly you know they start living their own lives and they disappear and you're just kind of left wondering like what the fuck well, happened? What, what changed like what because in some sometimes things don't change for uh, most of the time things don't change for people at the same time so you have one person that's going through all these new life experiences and they change into a different person meanwhile you're just the same person and you're like wondering well what the fuck like what, what, why'd you change them? Right. And, and then next thing you know, you, you hit those life experiences and you change. Right, and you do. It's already too late. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, that's why I like this song, man. Cause... Yeah, it was a good one. It was good. Uh, I don't know if refreshing is the right word, but in, in a way, refreshing. You know what I mean? <laughs> to, just to know that there's more... Uh, Variety <laughs> within the same sad, type of music. Sad Africans out there. Yeah, <laughs> nice to know they're <laughs> sad over there. Yeah. But yeah, man, it's, 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 but no, it's, it's nice to know that it exists. Just like one, just joyful. Just ah, yeah, it's relatable. It's relatable. Yeah, that's so. the word. Relatable. <laughs> yeah. Well, all right. If you guys like this reaction, you want to see more like it. Be sure to comment, subscribe, hit the thumbs up, all that good stuff. And if you do that, we'll catch you next time. Peace.